Hello and welcome to this short review of the Ugritone TrueCaps Sweedeath IRs. The Sweetf IRs are specifically designed to sound good in a chainsaw setting, I think. And that's what we're trying out right now. First of all, I will give you a quick overview of what we're about to see. When you purchase the Sweetf IRs, you basically get five different IR settings. And um, those are called Demo 1990, Inferior, Intergrave, Left Path and Spectral Sanity. So, those are reminiscent to specific bands and sounds. I think Demo 1990 refers to the first Nihilist demos. Inferior, I actually have no idea. Into Grave sounds like Grave. Left Path should be obvious and Spectral Sanity should refer to uh, Edge of Sanity. Okay, in each and every folder we have two presets. And we have a center mic, edge mic, far mic, rear mic, room mic, side mic, tube sizzle mic. So when I activate the full reset, you basically see now we have all the mics and the center is always here. It's um, in, on the website, it says it's an SM57 side, SM57 as well. Edge, I think it's an SM57 as well. The rear is... Uh, I will blend it on to the screen, but it's basically behind the uh, cap. Then we have far with a room mic, I think it's a Neumann, and then we have a tube sizzle mic. Okay, and we also have a main setting that basically just has four mics, and uh, we also have high pass, engaged, and some volume settings. Okay, with this being said, let me show you my signal chain. I thought it would be best to try this through a chainsaw sound that I know works. And therefore I chose uh, my guitar goes directly into my Rupert Niv. Oh, it's uh, my Black Hat Custom. It goes directly into the Rupert Niv DI box. And then we go into uh, basically four plugins. The first one is just a tuner. I could actually disengage it. Uh, next one is the Solidus VS 8100 by Audiority. It's a Marshall Wolfstate clone with much more. And as you can see, I've enabled my chainsaw setting. And it sounds like this. So I know this sounds good. Now let me deactivate the cabinet. We don't have the cabinet anymore. And then we will go into the true cap and then I've just enabled a Blue Cat's Gain 3 plugin. It's basically just a gain plugin and I've decreased the gain, otherwise I would be clipping. Okay, so true cap activated. Let's start with demo 1990 and the main. Just what do we get right out of the box? Okay, a full reset. I, I won't tweak it here. I could tweak it. I could tweak it with the EQ. Won't do it. Uh, so, full reset. So, and this preset I will actually tweak a bit.
Nice. Let's continue with the inferior ni inferior main. And full reset. This one is way louder than the demo 1990. Uh, could actually use. Okay, I won't tweak every setting here. Um, so let's go to into grave. Full reset. Okay, this one is really boomy, and uh, but you could easily fix it by applying a high pass and some volume tweaks. So next one, left path. Okay, and now the last one, Spectral Sanity. Way different. Let me actually tweak this one as well, because it's so different, it's quite nice.
Okay, and those were all the sweet death IRs you get. You can, of course, uh, only use, for instance, the power of the Spectral Sanity, or you could combine them however you want. For instance, you can use all Santa uh, IRs from the different uh, folders. However, that's too much playing around for me. I simply enjoy uh, going to the full reset and then tweak uh, the sound as I want it. Maybe in the future I will play with this. Okay, so final verdict. So far I think those IRs sound really good. I especially like the demo 1990 and then the left path. I also really enjoy Spectral Sanity, although it sounds totally different. My least favorite one is the inferior and the into grave, but um, they're totally usable. I think it's really easy to control, uh, especially with the TrueCap browser with uh, with the TrueCap plugin. With some other plugins, your experiences might differ. And um, we also have some tweaking options we haven't talked about. We have this EQ here. And we also have one IR slot left. We have some low path, high pass, and some panning options. And yeah. So I think they're almost every time on sale, or at least they're dirt cheap. I think I bought the whole pack for about, it was under 50 euro. And I think right now they're on sale. So every pack, it's not just the Sweet Death, but every one of those you can write, see right here. Oh, it's on sale for around 30 to 40. And I will try out the other ones, but so far the Sweet Death IR pack was um, my most favorite to try out. So let me know down in the comments what's do you think about the Ugritone IRs? Have you heard of them? And what are your favorite IRs? My favorite IRs are still the Bogren Rhythm IRs. However, I might switch over to those, at least when I'm totally on the in the box. And yeah, if you want to support this channel and you might want to check out the Solidus plugin, check out the links in the description. And with that said, Thank you for watching, don't forget to subscribe, may the force be with you and have a nice day.